Hi, this is Ken Kaplan from the New England Motorcycle Museum, and I'm proud to be representing one of the most rare Harley Davidson Armakis uh, made that I know of. This is the 1966 C model. Less than 600 of these were originally produced. There's only a handful known to exist. This was found in a local collector's uh, collection. Who um, we purchased 12 bikes from him. This C model is an original paint. The tank has not been repainted. It's in unrestored condition. It does kick over. Um, the engine is not seized and it's a, definitely a worthy bike of a restoration. It has low, low miles, 4,432 miles. Um, it has a lot of the original patina because it has not been restored. It has the original Harley Davidson, at least grips, they say Harley Davidson's on them. Those are 50 year old grips, original levers, bars. Um, the original foot pegs are in excellent condition indicating this bike has not been used off-road or abused. The C model had the 17 inch tires on it, so it's a little bit lower to the ground, a little sportier handling bike. Um, original seat, original seat cover. Uh, it's got a couple of tears in it, so that was held together with some, with some uh, black tape. Uh, the original trim band on the seat is in excellent shape. The original headlight is intact. Forks are in good shape. Um, just overall, an uh, excellent original Survivor. It has the original Del Ordo carburetor. Come around this side, Kenny. Show them the carb here. The original uh, Del Ordo carb with the uh, original air cleaner on there. Uh, the cylinder heads are in excellent shape. No damage to the fins. The cases are in nice shape. This is a matching, confirmed matching numbers bike. The engine uh, is the original engine on this bike. Uh, it's a serial number 66C, which denotes it's a 1966 C model Armaki. Uh, serial number 2534 appears to be all original, um, has the uh, uh, double-sided shifter here, which is kind of cool. You can uh, use the, your toe or your heel to shift. Uh, kickstand's intact, original up pipe, appears to be in good condition. Um, that's about all I can tell you about it. If you have any questions, give us a call, 860-454-7024. If you check the NADA model, this is the C model. It is listed as a uh, NADA value of 7,000. $970. Good luck finding an original paint one like this. It's just not out there. I would say there's less than a handful of these in the continent of the United States left because these were small bikes that were very fun to ride and, and they generally got written right into the ground. So to find an original survivor with original paint like this is uh, very, very few and far between. You can check our completed listings. We just sold a collection of six small Armakis and they ranged in the uh, they were a little bit less valuable models, but we had one sell for 5,000. Similar condition of this, not running. Um, that one was actually seized, but it was the motocross version that bought $5,000 at auction. So I would suspect this one will be uh, north of that, but we'll let the market determine what it's worth. Uh, low reserve, fantastic original survivor. All proceeds from the sale of the motorcycle are going to fund the New England Motorcycle Museum restoration project. Check us out online. Uh, we're gonna be a motorcyclist post this month. And um, there's a lot of uh, motorcycle history here. You're helping preserve motorcycle history by purchasing this bike. You're buying a piece of moto history. Guaranteed to outpace the stock market. These are going up in value. Um, this is, again, an original paint. Just, just so rare to find it with the original decals. Uh, 1966, making the motorcycle 51 years old. True antique, classic, fantastic bike. If you have any questions, you want to come see it, uh, we're here five days a week, Monday through Friday, 9 to 6, at 860-454-7024. Uh, the Armaki aficionados call the, this particular head the knucklehead, because um, it's kind of similar, uh, it has a unique valve cover, valve type uh, head setup on it, and um, has an original horn on it. Bike's all there, so one of the nicest original survivors. It kicks over, the Kickstarter assembly works great. Kicks, kicks over no problem. And it go, goes in the gear no problem. Um, we've got about 95 bikes waiting to be restored, about a two year backlog on motorcycle restorations, otherwise we do it ourselves, but bikes being sold as is. Um, we had a local collector actually buy three of the Armakis we had in our last auction, and uh, four of them, Jay said four of them, he's the one who bought that motocross one, right? and uh, he was hanging them in his airplane hangar, his modern art, right? Is that what he was doing? So, um, just a beautiful piece of moto history. Uh, I like this view on this side the best. The tank just looks 
uh, from where I'm standing right here. This view of the black and white vintage tank with the gorgeous original, original Harley Davidson logo. It's just super, super rare. We see so many bikes come through that have been repainted and molested. Um, this is original paint on the tank and the front and rear fender. I believe the frame and the, um, the uh, some frame and the uh, chain guide have been touched up with a rust preventative paint to keep it from uh, degrading in quality at all. But the tank and fenders and rear fender are original paint, just super, super cool. Um, got a couple beauty marks on it, as you'd expect on the tank and the fenders from a bike of this vintage, but it's all there. So good luck bidding on the bike and God bless America.